Jordan van Forest. Now we're joined by Hans Niemann. Um, a bad ending to the day, but you are through the knockouts. Congratulations. Well, uh, yeah, thank you. But uh, <laughs> today I was uh, torturing quite a bit. Uh, I mean, uh, being tortured. Uh, Prague was torturing me. Jordan was torturing me. So this was, uh, it was never ending torture, but um, I'm, I guess, into the top eight. So I should be happy about that. Yeah, building up uh, points before this day. So, so you are definitely ready for quarterfinals to face. Do you know who you're going to face? Magnus, I think. Yeah, that's true. What is that going to be like? Well, uh, I think uh, uh, obviously the opportunity to play him in a match uh, will be great. I think that um, uh, eight-year-old me would be very proud uh, to, to be reaching this point in my career. So. I'm just going to enjoy uh, the match and, uh, fight and do my best. Well, that sounds like uh, the perfect plan. How, how many times have you played Magnus? Sort of, uh, what kind of experiences do you have with him? Uh, no, no positive ones uh, yet. <laughs> uh, both times we played were in the tour, um, but again, uh, it's a uh, four-game match. Uh, I will just uh, do my best to try to give him a, a good fight. And of course, the chessable course is coming out, I think it's in two days, on the Joe Bava London. Of course, you don't want to re reveal anything uh, here, but uh, are you feeling confident with some openings going into the match with Magnus? Uh, yeah, feeling uh, very confident. Um, I definitely would like to stay in the tournament until my course is released, just so I can fully uh, promote it and plug it at every single moment in interview. Um, but uh, again, I think um, uh, Magnus is, of course, a very, very strong player. So it'll be a very difficult match, but um, it's the first time for me to have such an experience. So uh, I'm definitely just very excited uh, yeah. to have the opportunity. And we're so happy for you. And we do love that you're always so confident. But being only 18 and being now ready for knockout in a big tournament and to face the world champion, what does that mean to you? Uh, it means a lot. Um, I think if I, you know, one year ago I was a, a Harvard reject with no uh, potential in life. And uh, I think like a year ago, you know, I was 25, maybe 20. I was barely a grandmaster. I had just like, you know, got rejected uh, from my dream school, you could say. So one year ago, things were looking pretty bleak. But um, to be at, at this moment, to play Magnus uh, in, in a match and make it to the top eight, and uh, this is uh, definitely, in some cases, a, a dream come true. So obviously, I would just uh, cherish uh, the moment because uh, the fact that I'm even a professional chess player now is a complete miracle. Um, it would have been so easy for me to uh, be, you know, a professional streamer or, or go to college. But uh, the fact that I've been given this opportunity to be a professional chess player, uh, I'm very grateful for and, and will make the most of. Such an inspiration. Um, we wish you the best of luck, Hans. It's going to be super exciting to follow your match with Magnus tomorrow. So best of luck. Thank you. Thanks for joining us.